Hi, my name is Larissa Neuburger and I'm a third year PhD student here in the Department of Tourism, Hospitality and Event Management. Um, my research focus is on immersive technologies or technologies in general in tourism with um, the special focus on immersive technologies such as augmented and virtual reality. I studied in my master already tourism and I used augmented reality for museums to look at tourism experience and this is where my passion came for like technologies like VR and AR and how we can use them um, for tourism and that passion stayed with me and now I want to look at um, AR for historic sites especially in the context of the south of the United States and slavery tourism sites that that will be um, the work I will work on in my dissertation. The main problems I want to address with my research is basically how to make historic sites interesting again and how to make history alive again for tourists and for visitors of these sites and especially in the context of like very complex historic topics or very sensitive historic topics it is important to use technology as a mediator that um, you can use to make visitors more interested in the history but also to make them understand things better and to make them think about certain things when they visit historic sites and tourism sites. So all my projects um, are normally working together um, with a partner, with a partner site that is basically coming from the industry. So I always try to kind of make a win-win relationship um, between the site that um, has the possibility to provide a better experience to visitors, but also to use um, the research that I'm doing to kind of argue things for themselves, um, so to get more visitors, but also to know how to make interpretation efforts better. And on the other side, of course, it's very interesting for me as a researcher to work together with these sites and to see the industry, but um, always think about basically their problems and their issues and how to make um, their work better and not only my own work, because I think it's really important that research is applied and also accessible, um, especially in tourism. Um, recently, I'm very interested in humanities and digital humanities um, in that kind of area. And um, I'm taking classes in history and I'm involved in oral history projects and as my dissertation is very much linked to African-American history, um, I'm very much involved um, to see how we can use oral history as well for tourism, not only as a research method, but also how to involve this really, really um, valuable material for tourism. So we reach out to other departments that already have past experiences with augmented and virtual rea reality um, projects in completely different areas to kind of compare our experiences and our knowledge. Um, we're basically working now on a grant where we get um, different people involved from archaeology, anthropology and history and also reach out to other universities to really get their expertise on um, different aspects and projects because as we know, tourism is very multidisciplinary and that is where um, we actually try to involve a lot of other departments and universities as well. Um, so I started teaching last semester and um, I'm teaching event promotion, what is basically a crash course in event marketing and a very creative way um, to teach students how to create their own marketing campaign. So they basically learn in my class how to establish their own website, how to design a flyer, um, how to design an Instagram post for a certain target group that is connected to the event. So I want to make my class very applied and a little bit different than theoretical classes and that comes from my experience in event marketing. Because if you know like very good concepts from marketing in general, it's very easy to actually apply them to small events, big events, so a student can really like take out their knowledge basically out of a toolbox. 
And it's really fun to actually teach um, event marketing and see their projects in the end.